so friends we are discussing about advanced php and we have covered about basic concept of advanced php and some class object inheritance concept and last we have discussed about abstract class so today we will discuss about interface so what is interface basically interface defines a contract which a class must fulfill as you know a php class is like a blueprint for an object same like an interface is a blueprint of classes so you can say any class implementing a given interface can be expected to have a same behavior in terms of what can be called and how it can be called and what will be the returned so let's take an example to make it more clear so here create an interface so suppose i am creating interface to create an interface we need to use the keyword that is interface and after that the vehicle okay so it is look like the blueprint of class so we don't need to write class here in our previous example when we create any class we are just using the class vehicle that means vehicle is the name of the class but if we want to create an interface we don't need to write the class keyword we just need to write the interface keyword here so that this will treat as a interface okay and in the interface we can create a function suppose i am writing a public function so here write public function and details so i want to write something in the details method but as you know this is an interface so we don't need to write anything in this function here we are just declaring the function but the function body will be called where we will implement these things basically when you create any class and want to call that class from the child class we will just extend it but for interface we need to implements that things so just create a class suppose i am creating a class the name of the class is car and i want to extend so as it is the interface so we need to write the implements so write implements this is the keyword to call an interface and name of the class so basically the vehicles is the interface class okay so here we can write the same function with the full implementation so here we will write any things inside the body so i am writing in things suppose like return car has four wheels and this will be called just like another class that is just create a object of the car class so write a new keyword to creating object and then car okay so we are creating an object that is dollar obj is the object of the car class and to call the details method so just use the dollar obj and the name of the method that is details so if we just echo these things write echo here and if you go to the browser we can see the output car has four wheels so same like if you create another class suppose i am creating another class that is just copy from this previous and create a new one suppose bus okay and i am implementing the same things that is vehicle and here we are using the same details method and just change the text so bus has six wheels and if we want to call these things we can write so here i am writing the echo beer to display in the new line and create another object that is obj1 i am creating a different object from the car and this is the bus okay so obj1 is the object of bus class and write here obj1 and call the details okay so just echo these things and if we go to the browser we can see the output car has four wheels which are coming from the first echo and then bus has six wheels so it is coming from this so we are calling the same interface methods from the different class so the same things we can do any inheritance so why we will use 
the interface this is looks like same as the abstract class also so why we will use the interface so if you go to the previous disk example that is the abstract so we are just using the abstract and we are creating a methods and we are calling and we are getting the same output so why will use interface so basically there is a minor difference so if you go to the interface class and if you go to the abstract class we can see in the abstract class we are defining a properties inside the abstract class but in interface we cannot define any property and if you check in the function details this is the public that means in interface all the function will be the public and if you go to the abstract class we can use the protected also the private is not allowed for both the case so for interface all are public but in abstract we can use the public as well as the protected also so by default all the interface methods are looks like abstract and it will work as the abstract class so they cannot be implemented to code but abstract class is not necessary so here we can use our own functions also so all the functions should not be abstract but in the interface all the functions will work just like abstract and one of the important things to declare any interface class we need to use the interface and we don't need to write any class keyword for abstract we need to use the class keyword as well as abstract also and here we need to implement for the interface case and for abstract we will just use the inheritance concept that is the extends keyword so this is the minor and you can say this is the difference between the interface and abstract class so this was one of the most useful concept of object oriented concept if you have any queries about this video please comment in a below comment section so up to this all are the basic concept of inheritance that is there is a base class and child class relationship so in the abstract class also in the interface also and you have a normal inheritance also so the my question is here we are implementing or extending one parent class from the child class suppose there are multiple parent class and we are going to call this from a single child class so how this can be happen so basically this is calling as a multiple inheritance so suppose one class a and another class is b and this is the child class c so i want to use class a as well as class b from class c how it can be happen so in next day we will going to discuss about these things so please like and subscribe to this channel for upcoming video thanks for watching this video have a good day bye